All right, this is unequivocally the easiest song you will ever learn, and it's a great song. It's called Helpless by Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young, and there's only three chords. D, A, and G. All in that order, all the way through. I also want to point out that it's a great song to show off some um, quick chord changes um, and uh, shortcuts that you can make. So when you get to start on this D, you make your D shape obviously just like that. Um, when going to the A, um, I like to use my three fingers. Um, some people like to bar it, like something like that. Um, I just think it's a lot easier um, since a lot of times you be coming from this D. Um, you could just curl these fingers up and make the A shape. So you keep your index finger where it's at. You just kind of slide it over just a little bit uh, to make room and kind of get this bunk bed, bunk bed formation of the middle finger on the D string, uh, keeping the index finger where it is on the G string, and then the ring finger right below it on the B string. And there it is. And you can just revert back right to the D um, if any other song calls for it. But in this song, it's just going to be D to A. Um, you can practice that just by doing the changes. You don't have to strum at all. You can just do that until you get used to it. Form that muscle memory. And then um, from the A to the G, you know, there's no quick change there. But from the G back to the D, there is. Uh, so if you make your G like this, all you gotta do is hold your ring finger down. I know it's tough at first. Um, just like I said, don't you don't have to strum. Um, just make that shape. So all you gotta do is just make your D shape from that G. So again, keeping the ring finger down, get the pinky off, and then put the index and the middle finger where they need to go, respectively, for the D chord. Um, and that's pretty much it. I mean, that's the whole song. If you wanna run through the lyrics kind of uh, very quickly here, it's just, um, there is a sound. D-A-G, DAG, all the way through um, a million times over that sequence. But again, you know, this is just one of those songs where you just have these learning blocks of um, three chord songs. Uh, we have some shortcuts, the D to the A, and then the G to the D, in an actual real song. So it's actually going to help you out, um, just piece that all together. I appreciate all the new subscribers. This is an easy one for everybody. Um, and it's a great song. Um, if you haven't um, checked them out before, obviously, you know, they're from the 60s, and that's kind of the folky vibe that you get from this channel. Um, but having said that, we will do any song that you guys want. Um, so just uh, leave a comment, and um, I'll get to it.